Your monitor is plugged in, your laptop is running, but all you get is a blank screen. Frustrating, right? Let's walk through every possible fix so you can get things back up and running quickly. No guesswork, just solutions that work. Number one, check your connections. The first thing to do is the simplest check your cables. Make sure everything is plugged in tightly on both ends. Sometimes the cable looks fine, but it's not fully inserted. If you're using an adapter, double check that too. If possible, swap cables or try a different HDMI or USB-C port on your laptop. Number two, make sure the monitor is powered on. Okay, this one might seem obvious, but trust me, it happens. Is your monitor turned on? Check the power button. Most monitors have an indicator light that lets you know it's receiving power. Number three, select the correct input source on the monitor. Now, even if everything is plugged in correctly, your monitor might not be showing the laptop screen because it's set to the wrong input source. Press the input or source button on your monitor and make sure it's set to HDMI, DisplayPort, or whatever cable you're using. Number four, restart the devices. Time for the good old turn it off and on again trick. Restart both your laptop and monitor. While you're at it, unplug the cable and reconnect it after a few seconds. Number five, update or reinstall graphics drivers. Sometimes it's the software that's causing the issue. Head over to device manager on your laptop. Just press Windows plus X and select it. Under display adapters, right click your graphics card and either update the driver or reinstall it. If a recent driver update caused the issue, try rolling it back. Number six, adjust display settings on your laptop. If the screen is still not showing up, let's head over to your laptop's display settings. Go to setting system display and look under multiple displays. Click detect to force your laptop to find the monitor. And if you're using a wireless display, click on connect. Number seven, check hardware. It's time to rule out hardware issues. Try connecting your monitor to another computer or use a different cable. If the monitor works elsewhere, the issue might be with your laptop's port. On the other hand, if your monitor isn't working on any device, it could be faulty. Number eight, use the graphics control panel. Now, if you have a dedicated graphics card like NVIDIA or an integrated one like Intel, you'll want to tweak the settings in their control panels. Open the control panel for your graphics card and under the display section, look for multiple display options. If you see a detect option, click it. Number nine, check for BIOS or firmware issues. In rare cases, a BIOS setting or outdated monitor firmware might be the issue. You can reset the BIOS settings by restarting your laptop and pressing the correct key, usually F2 or Dell. You can also check your monitor's manufacturer website for firmware updates. If you follow these steps, you should be able to get your monitor up and running in no time. Let me know in the comments which solution worked for you. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Conscious Guide for more tech troubleshooting tips.